Posture check. Were you just sitting like a shrimp? Be honest. When was the last time you stood up? How long have you been playing games for and watching YouTube videos? I know, my videos are great. They suck you in, you don't want to stop watching them. But if you're anything like me, you've been sitting in your chair for way too long. Which is why I was very excited when the Progressive Desk Company reached out to me and asked if I wanted to do a collaboration with them for their Solo Riser Standing Desk. No more shrimp posture for me. <laughs> now when the desk first came in, it was a little daunting because it came in three boxes. One giant box with the tabletop, one box that was very heavy with all of the equipment for the actual frame, and one box that had all of the extra components that I ordered for cable management. But don't worry, because when I opened the boxes, they were all very clearly marked. Everything was designed to fit in its perfect little spot, so I knew exactly what everything was, and it was the easiest unboxing I've probably ever done. <laughs> all I needed was scissors for the tape on the outside, and that was it. Everything came in its nice little baggies for the screws that you needed, and for the little Allen wrench, everything was so perfectly fit in the boxes that it was just chef's kiss. <laughs> for someone like me who's hyper-organized, it really made me happy, especially when directions can be a little overwhelming because it's a bunch of pictures. The way this was boxed was so easy, even a lightweight could do it. <laughs> which leads me to the actual setup, which was even easier. When I say so easy a lightweight could do it, I literally mean I did it by myself. I know, I know, round of applause. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You've all seen my unboxing videos before. You know how chaotic they are. So you can imagine when I'm trying to put together furniture, it typically doesn't go well for me. I ran into zero issues with this setup, zero. I needed no help. The directions were so clear. There was only a couple screws that all they needed were my little Allen wrench that was included. So it was super, super simple. Now there's one part where I probably could have used a drill. A smarter person would have used a drill. That's not me. I didn't use a drill. I hand screwed them in cause I'm strong. <laughs> so that part took me a little bit longer and it probably made it more difficult than it needed to be. However, if you had a drill, that whole part would have been done in under a minute because it would have been two, maybe four holes, depending on the, the components that you got or you wanted to add. Um, I had four holes that I needed to hand screw screws into, but they gave me these awesome, I don't know, I'm gonna call them wood screws. That's probably not the technical term, but it had a special little end on, so it just like went right in so easy. So easy. It was the best. I was so proud of myself. Mr. Light got home and I was like, look what I did, look what I did. <laughs> Cause I was just so proud. And under an hour, super fast, super simple, no complications. One of the things I was most excited about was the fact that I was able to pre-program different heights. And that was also super simple. I think that's gonna be the theme of this video because when I tell you this desk is like the easiest thing I've ever had to, to do before, everything just worked right the first time. It just, it was beautiful, it was beautiful. Super simple to program, only a couple of buttons and you have three options you can program. So personally, I had a sitting option and then I had two different standing heights. One standing height for when I'm doing my artsy craftier things like my Legos or using my Cricut um, and one height for when I wanted to be standing and typing and editing and things like that where I would need my arms at a more ergonomical position. <laughs> uh, and then the sitting height for when, obviously, when I wanna sit down, when I'm writing in my planner or doing things, you know, maybe I just wanna sit down for a little while because that's what I'm used to, sitting down. But anyways, three, three options that were super simple to program and it just works so beautifully. I push the button, I walk away and do what I need to do. I come back and the desk is where I want it to be. I don't have to mess with it because it's pre-programmed already. Now I've only had the desk for two days, but I'm already using it for pretty much everything. <laughs> um, anytime I'm using my laptop, I'm over on that desk. Anytime I'm crafting, I'm over on that desk. Anytime I'm working on my Legos, which this only happened one time for a very brief period of time because that's all Baby Light allowed for. I was working on that desk. It's the first time I've been able to do things without the fear of Baby Light being able to snatch them off because things that I don't want her to touch, I simply do standing and it's too high for her to reach and it's 
been wonderful. <laughs> so I'm finally able to do things for me that are some of my crafts, that are some things that I like to do for fun without fear of a child snatching things she shouldn't be snatching. <laughs> um, but more importantly, I am also going to be moving my setup over to that desk so that I can edit because it takes forever to edit. If you guys have been around the channel for a while, you know, one of the reasons why I stopped doing my reaction videos was because of how long they would take to edit. And part of that problem was because I was just so uncomfortable. A 30 minute episode was taking me roughly two to three hours to edit. Two to three hours in, you know, even the most comfortable chair, it just really starts to, to wear on your back, wear on your neck. I was very uncomfortable. I was getting a lot of headaches. Um, so this is gonna be great because I'll actually be able to stand, I'll be able to sit, and I'll be able to continue to work no matter what I need to do. So it's just, I can already tell, it's gonna be so much better, so much healthier for my body because one of the bad things about content creation is I spend a lot of time in my chair <laughs> when I should probably be spending more time standing or sitting. One of the other things I'm really excited about is all of the cable management management systems. Now, one thing that's really difficult for me is cable management because I'm constantly moving my electronics around. When I'm recording, I want my consoles in here, but when I'm just playing for fun, I move them to my living space because I want to be able to hang out with my family. So cable management has never really been possible for me because trying to do those Velcro ties and take them off and put them on, it's just, it's, it's a nightmare. <laughs> But the cable management system that I got from the Progressive Desk Company is super simple to add your cords into, and even more importantly, take your cords out of, and it doesn't mess anything up. They had a wide variety of options, but the one that I chose, I cannot sing the praises of enough. It takes me like two seconds to pull the cords out so I can move my systems, and then maybe like, I don't know, 10 seconds longer than that to put them in. <laughs> they thought of everything. So I really, really, really have to sing the praises of just the cable management system alone. Even if you don't want a whole desk, you need to at least look at the cable management system because it's just beautiful. Whatever genius designed it, I just, round of applause, round of applause. <laughs> Make sure to check out the Progressive Desk Company yourself. I have a link in the description below so you don't have to type anything in. You can just scroll down and click it. Do it, do it now. Uh, click the link below. And like I said, they have so many options to choose from, from cable management, to sizes of desk, to styles of desk, to colors. I went white on white on white because that's kind of the theme of this room right now, but it's just, it's beautiful. So check them out for yourself. Use code lightweightgamingdesk. Go do it. Click the link, click the link, click the link, click it, do it.